Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Christopher with Plan Your Truth and today I'm going to be doing a plan with me in my classic dashboard planner that I use for social media. So I want to use this, I have not used this book yet, Sophisticated Florals. I think it's really, really stunning. So I wanna use some things from here just to kind of at least kick us off and see where we go from there. So this is an outdated planner. I've already whited out some things. Uh, so we can just dive into some stickers here. Um, okay, so this is a really functional planner for me, which is great because there's a lot of functional boxes and things that will work really well. But let's start with some florals, okay? I'm kind of confused with this color. I think this is what I want to use, but it's coming off very orange. Let me see, because the other colors in the book are more pink, so I think it has to be pink, but let me try. So I want this down here, because I don't really use this area at all. Yeah, I think we can go with that. So that helps that area. Super pretty. I'm trying to, I, I said in yesterday's video, get away from just doing the same like corner situation. So I wanna try and incorporate some of these florals just like throughout the page. Kind of experiment a little bit with, with what I'm used to. I'm still really right now also figuring out how I wanna use this planner. If you use this layout for social media, let me know how you use it down below because I'm really not using this side too much. I know what I use this side for, but this side I struggle a little bit with. Um, but, so let's go with this kind of color vibe. I think there's some quotes up here that could be good. Yeah, I also love that there's, because I'm, I'm going off of this gray color, which I know is neutral, but still. Um, so I, I think I may even pull in, maybe this find the joy. Maybe we can do that right here to cover this part up. I think that's good. I want to bring in that color now over here somewhere, but we can work on that later. Okay, so I'm just going to kind of flip here and see what I want to do. I also really love this. Let's see if we could make this work to help fill this gap. Like put this right here, I'm thinking. Bloom, that's really cute. Okay, now I think we can start to get into some functional stuff over here. Again, I, I'm, I'm trying to figure some things out, but kind of like these circle ones to do. So we can do this color and the gray maybe. And this is where I can do my tracking. So kind of what my, my social media numbers are looking like. So let's do the gray right like that and the pink right like that. Yeah, I think that looks good. So we can do some tracking here, and then let's see if there is some kind of long, skinny, yes, yeah, something like this. Let's try the gray on gray, see how that looks. Yeah, I think that's okay. But then what I wanna do is I want to do, I wanna layer that kind of with some florals. Hmm, but maybe something like this would work. Yeah, because that's that same kind of color scheme. So maybe this could go right here. Hmm. Let me try this right here. I, I'm just mixing things up, doing things differently than I usually do. I think that's fun. And then we'll definitely bring this. We can kind of even use this as a washi strip. So we'll bring that to the other side for sure. But back to this. So I want to add a floral up here, but now let's do it in the top right corner. Just a little one. Let's try this one here. So I'm going to start with just the flower how I want it, which is kind of like, right like that. Just a little bit in the corner. So now we have the floral, floral, floral. That's good. And then back to these labels. 
Um, I think we'll just do, we'll stick with gray. So we'll do one like that. And then let me, tr I'll try this color. Maybe we can bring this in somewhere else because I really don't like the gray on gray. This looks good so far. Let me switch over, switch gears to this other side just so that we can get something here. Um, so I definitely need a big floral. This side is just a lot more functional, but let's see what we can do. Maybe this one we could do. And this one, I know I said I wanna go away from doing corner situations, but I just think it needs it. I just wanna do that. You know what, I, I know that I love how these look, so go with what you know, you know. I do want to go outside the box, so I like that I'm, I'm starting to, but, you know, this is my comfort zone still. So these scraps, I think we can add a little bit more over here. And a little bit up at the top. It's not a lot, but it's something. Cute. Okay, so then this, let me find this like washi strip thing that we did. It's not really washi, but. Okay, so let's see where that would look good. I think probably down here. Yeah, maybe something like that. I think that looks good. I ripped it a little bit here, but I think that it looks okay. So this is looking really simple and elegant, I think, right now. So I like that. Now, on on some of these days, this is where I write, like, what my Instagram post is. So I need some kind of boxes. So maybe we can just go back and forth with some of these different colors. So I think... I definitely need gray up here to, to kind of go against that, this color here. So let's try this one here on Tuesday. Um, and we may add some florals to that. I, I don't think I'm done yet, but, and then let's bring in this color because I we have the box that's up here that's like this color. So let's try that on Friday like that, and then we'll do another gray one on Saturday. Just totally alternating like that. Okay, let's see what other options we have in here. I think I saw some leaves in here. Yeah, let's try and add some of these in. Let's try here on this Tuesday box. If we just add it a little bit like that. I think that's really pretty. And then there is a gray, I think there's some gray leaves. Yes, there are. So we could do this one. Let's see if we can move this. I would love to do the leaf kind of like here and then this box over here. Yeah, I think that's really pretty. All right, we're getting somewhere. Um, let's see if there's some of those long skinny quotes. It's like this, enjoy the little moments. Let's see, I think that could go right down here on Sunday. Let me try, I'm gonna try it at the top. I think that looks better since that is there. And then there are just a couple, like there's this one, Joy Begins With Gratitude. And that, that just doesn't really match. So I'm not gonna use that one. Let's just, I'm gonna flip through here, see if there's anything else. What if I did some of these circles? So. I could do like a today 
and, and that same today, but we can do the pink color. So we did that right like that. I think that's cute. And then I probably want to do another one though on this side. I just, I would want one on this side, but I don't think that today really matches with, so let me see if I added another one here. Yeah, let's, I'm going to go with it. That's, again, something outside my comfort zone. I like it. Let's keep going. I think I'm almost done here. I just am kind of flipping through to see if there's anything else that could make it look pretty. But um, I think we're at a good spot. Let's maybe add a leaf or two to this side. So I like this one. So what I'm actually going to do is cut it so that it looks like it's coming from behind that box. Because then we could add it right like that. I love that, that's really pretty. Let me try a gray one up here somewhere. Let me try it right here. Yeah, I think that's good right there actually. Okay, so I just wrote in the dates and some of the other, you know, headings and categories of how I use this, but I think it came out really pretty, really, you know, simple. This is a really pretty book, and um, I can't wait to keep exploring it, but thank you so much for watching, and again, if you have any comments or suggestions on how you use this planner for social media or however, please let me know because I'm, I'm still trying to figure some things out, but thank you so much for watching. I really love how it came out. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button and remember to plan your truth so that you can live your truth. Thanks so much.